because a crocodile has teeth and a monkey doesn't. So one day a monkey was swinging in the trees and it found a crocodile and it said hello Mr Crocodile and the crocodile said what are you doing and the monkey said I'm swimming on trees and then the crocodile tried to eat the monkey by trying to bite them and he bit his hand but then the monkey just jumped up to the tree and, <laughs> and made the crocodile get really angry because he can't climb up to the tree so he tried to snap the monkey he broke the branch but the monkey jumped onto the next one so he jumped up and broke the other branch but the monkey climbed onto the next one the monkey was so clever he said hello mr hello mr crocodile and they didn't become friends yet because he was like chasing the monkey because um he wants to like eat the monkey so he, oh, he caught him and he like tried to eat him but he was like just too hard to eat so he went the monkey and the crocodile went to find something to eat the monkey jumped up in the trees and got some bananas but the crocodile didn't know what to eat because the bananas were so horrible so the monkey like um <laughs> see and the crocodile kept on snapping his mouth trying to eat the monkey and the monkey said no mr crocodile i won't let you get anything to eat if you don't if you stop don't stop eating me so the monkey said yes i'll find you something to eat and the crocodile said thank you very much i'm very hungry because i don't like bananas because monkeys do all right said the monkey so the crocodile the crocodile went to find something to eat and he found somebody and ate it all up the monkey ate all of the bananas and they lived happily ever after the end man it's great fun Done, that was excellent. Can you come through? They're sticking together, welding tighter, tighter. Let it out very, very slowly. Keep breathing deeply, keep breathing slowly. That will relax you more and more. Focusing now only on the sound of my voice. I'm now going to start to move some of you around. The rest hands will come right out the front. Julie, put your feet together for me. Toes and heels touching. Tip your head right back, close your eyes, Julie. Take a nice deep breath in, breathe in. Let it out very, very slowly. Julie, in a moment, you will feel yourself falling gently backwards. You will not fall, I will not let you fall. You'll just go in a nice, loose, limp, relaxed sleep. Nice, loose, limp, relaxed state. Deep breath in, Julie. So heavy, so tired, loose, limp and relaxed. Julie can still hear every word I say to her. She just doesn't care anymore. Every breath she now takes is like breathing in a sleeping gas. Such a relaxing feeling down there. Nothing at all disturbs her. All noises just send her deeper and deeper in this wonderful, lovely, loose limb, relaxed state. Hi, what's your name? Mandy. Mandy, keep concentrating on your hands. Feet together, Mandy. Looking forward to the show? No. Good, because you're going to miss it anyway. Head back, close your eyes. So heavy, loose, limp, and relaxed. Do you know these two lying down here? Pardon? Do you know these two lying down here? No. Good, because you're going to be sleeping with them in a moment. 
It's not that sort of show, so don't get carried away. And sleep. So heavy, so tired, loose, and relaxed. Scaring the shit out of you now, isn't it? Feet together, head back, close your eyes. What's your name? Marie. Marie, you are the weakest link. Goodbye. So many good subjects. I will let some of them go. Right, you can go back. You can go back. I'll keep you there for a moment. Seen all those? They're all hypnotized. 
I think I'll let you go back. Talk to each and every one of you now, sitting in the chairs. Keep your eyes closed at all times. Keep breathing deeply, keep breathing slowly. What hypnosis does is it amplifies your imagination. The more you use your imagination, the more fun you will have and the deeper the sleep you will go. We're now all going to go and use our imaginations together. I want you lot to imagine for me it is summer holiday time. We are jetting off somewhere nice and warm, somewhere nice and hot. All you have to do is use your imagination. I want you to imagine for me right now that we've jetted off to Hawaii, Spain, France, Barbados, anywhere you want. Imagine for me that you're lying around the pool, lying around the beach on a hot, hot, sunny summer day. It's 90 degrees in the shade today and there is no shade. In fact, the more you hear my voice, the hotter you now think it's getting. It's 91 degrees, 92, 93, 94 degrees out there in the shade today, but there is no shade. You've probably noticed by now, your mouth is getting dry, your throat is getting dry. You love a nice, cool, refreshing drink, but it keeps on getting hotter, hotter and hotter. 96, 97, 98, 99 degrees out there in the shade today, but there is no shade. Your mouth is dry, your throat is dry. You love a nice, cool, refreshing drink. On the next count of three, with your eyes closed, if you hold your hand out in front of you, the drinks waiter will come round and give you your favorite drink. Drink down that imaginary drink, and amazingly, your thirst will disappear. Next count of three, with your eyes closed, pull your hands right out in front, and the drinks waiter will give you your favorite drink. Here he comes, one, two, three, hold your hand out. Start drinking that drink. It's cool, it's refreshing. You can have as many as you want, as soon as I thought you'd want another one. Drink them down. They're cool, they're refreshing. You, yes. Too many vodkas for that one. You've all had enough to drink now. Put the glasses back down by the side of your chair. Sit back and enjoy your holiday. Sit back and enjoy the sunshine. But it's so hot today. I don't want you to burn. Reach down by the side of your chair and pick up your suntan cream. Start spreading it all over. It's cool, it's refreshing. Person up touching out your knees, it's burning, you're playing on your knees. It's your ears, it's burning, you're playing on your ears. It's your nose, it's burning, you're playing on your nose. We've all got enough suntan cream on now. Put the bottles back down by the side of your chair. Sit back and enjoy the sunshine. Sit back and enjoy the holiday. We you have another craving coming on right now. We love a nice, cool, refreshing ice cream. Nice, cool, cornered. Same thing again, with your eyes closed. Pull your hands right out in front of you and the waiter will give you your favorite ice cream. One, two, three, here he comes. Start licking that ice cream, start licking that cornered. Feels really, really nice. But it's so hot today, they are starting to melt. They're running down over the backs of your hand. Lick that drip off the bottom of the cornet. And in doing that, you have ice cream all over your nose. Lick that drip off with your tongue. Lick that drip off with your tongue. And relax and sleep. Straight the world's greatest actresses. But this is an acting school of the imagination. Where if I suggest a part to you, your body will act how things that part should be acted. Whether it be a football, motor car, your body will act how it thinks it should be acted. Today, you are all going to go and take part in the world's greatest horse race. <laughs> You're going to ride this year's favourite in the Grand National. Your chairs are stuck to the floor. Your chairs will not move. I will talk you through the race. On the next count of three, with your eyes closed, reaching out in front of you and grabbing the reins. One, two, three. You're reaching out in front and grabbing the reins. Give your horse a little tickle under the chin. Is yours enjoying that? Should be, you're sitting on yours the wrong way around. One, two, three, and they're off. Riding along, riding along. Neck and neck, neck and neck. Use a whip on your horse, use a whip. You're now coming to the first fence. Get ready, one, two, three. Yep, and over. We've lost one at the first fence. Here comes another fence. One, two, three, yep, and over. Yes, you've made it. We're now coming to one of the biggest fences on the course. This is Beaches Brook. We're going to take a big jump to get over this one. Get ready. 
One, two, three, up. And over. Yes, you've made it. You're now out on the home straight. If you look over your shoulder, you can see the chockies behind you closing in on you. Show the chockies back there exactly what you think of them. Yes, and you've won the race. You've won the race. So relax and sleep. Straight back to sleep. Only talking to the person I'm touching on the shoulders now. One, two, three, wide awake. Hi, you fell off your horse. <laughs> you fell off your horse. <laughs> the first jump, you're right. <laughs> so, There's different levels of hypnosis, there's a light state, medium state and a deep state. That changes as the show goes on. Just to give you a brief insight, he's in a light state, she's in a medium state, she's in a deep state, she's in a deep state. He's in a hell of a state. <laughs> How much of that's my fault, I'm not sure, but I'm sure we'll find out as the show goes on. On the next count of three, you will curl up all small and tight. You will become a tiny, tight, little seedling. The sun is going to shine, you are going to get watered. You will sprout little sprouts, shoot little shoots. You'll grow up, up and up. You'll be standing on the floor becoming the biggest, tallest tree there's ever, ever been in a park today. Next count of three, kill the ball small and tight. One, two, three, you're a tiny, tight little seedling. Kill the ball small and tight. Sun is starting to shine. You're getting watered. You're sprouting little sprouts. Shooting little shoots. Growing up, up, and up. You'll be standing on the floor, reaching high in the sky. <laughs> Biggest, tallest train of park. You'll be standing on the floor. Reaching high in the sky. <laughs> Today would be nice. Just put some fill eyes on this one, it's sprouting up really quick. Big tall tree. Just swaying in the breeze today. This one's a bonsai tree, if anyone's wondering, that's why it's so small. No cares, no worries, just swaying in the breeze today. But it's been raining in the park today and you have water all over your leaves. Shake that water off of me right now. Yes, all the water's gone. Happy little trees again, just swaying in the breeze. But there's a dirty little dog just coming as park today. He's looking round, he's sniffing round. If I touch your tree in the shoulder, you have to tell that little doggy exactly what you think of him if you want him to go away. He's looking around, he's sniffing around, stopping at the bottom of the tree, I'm touching right now. What, you want to tell that little dog? Fuck off. Yes, he's gone, he's moved on to someone else's tree, he's looking around, he's sniffing around. Stopping at the bottom of the mighty old dog, I'm touching right now. What, you want to tell that little dog? Yes, I think you got the message. Stopping at the bottom of the tree, I'm touching right now. What are you going to tell this little dog? Go to sleep. Yes. <laughs> uh, no? Hey, yeah. yeah, you reckon? I'm not sure about this one. He's looking around, he's sniffing around. He's stopping at the bottom of the nasty oak. I'm touching right now. What are you going to tell our little dog? I did, did try to warn you. <laughs> Next count of three, your hands will fall by your side where you can stand and sleep. One, two, three, stand and sleep. You now stay in whatever position I put you in.
Let's talk to the band. Yeah. 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 If I touch you on the shoulder, you'll be wide awake. As soon as I click my fingers, 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 back in front of your face, you'll go back to doing what you were doing before I woke you up. Only Tony, you'll find two joints on it. Hi. What I've done is I've hypnotized all these up here. <laughs> the whole thing that... No, he's a, he's a conductor, he's picking the next tune. He's playing the guitar, she's playing the drums, she's playing the violin. You would never do that, would you? I wouldn't. Come on, have a look at him. Don't want to hit the She's playing the drums, he's playing the guitar, she's playing the trombone. He's not very lively. Do you think you'd be a bit more lively than that? Cheers. What do we need? What do we need? Hi. Got more hypnotized. Well, she, yeah, no. He's a conductor, I may find he's picking the next tune. Oh, well, they've had his face. What? They've had his face. You would never do that, would you? No. Sure will. Next count of three, you'll all be wide awake. Still doing what you're doing, wondering why the hell you're doing it. One, two, three, wide awake, wiggy wiggy, wide awake. <laughs> Have a seat. Bring your seats forward a little bit. I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> what I've done is I've picked five of you with really good imaginations. But I did tell you all a little lie when I came up here. <laughs> I'm not surprised. I told you lot it was all about relaxation, all about concentration, but it's not. I use a special kind of microphone. This is called a hypnotic microphone. What happens here if I touch you on the head, you go instantly back to sleep. That's how we do it. What? You don't believe a word of a day? Nah. Watch the mic. <laughs> Wouldn't work on you, would it? No. no. Grab hold of the microphone for me. Tap yourself gently on the head with it. Diva, and you better sleep. Talking to the guys I'm touching now and now. Guys, keep on sleeping, keep on relaxing, but listening to this piece of music. Next time you're awake and you hear that piece of music, you will think you're the one and only Robbie Williams. <laughs> Guys, keep on sleeping, keep on relaxing, but listening to this piece of music. of music, you'll think you're sexy, sexy Madonna. You will get up out of your seats, dancing around the floor area, at all times being very careful for the equipment and the edge of the stage. Girls, you won't know why you're doing it. You can't stop yourselves from doing it. You will just have an overwhelming desire to get up out of your seat and dance around the floor area. Just like you've seen Madonna do in those sexy, sexy videos. Only until your special piece of music comes on, though. Each and every one of you, one, two, three, wide awake. Wakey, wakey, wide awake. 
How are you? You're wide awake now, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. So while I hypnotize the fellas, I'm just going to get Neil to play a little piece of music. Where you go, guys? Come on. <laughs> Wasn't that strange? It was. <laughs> I did tell you though, when you came up here, you would be fully aware of everything you were doing. That's right, isn't it? Yeah, but what was I doing that for? <laughs> I don't know, but the worst thing is, every time you hear that piece of music, you do that all over again. <laughs> At the bird. <laughs> all I do is say, music! Here you go! More noise you make, the better these get. Wakey wakey guys, come and have a seat. Wasn't that crazy? No. Oh. Let you know a little secret. You can hypnotize the fellas and get fellas to do that sort of thing. You could never get a girl to do that though, could you? No. Girls are known as a fairer sex. That's right, isn't it? Yeah. 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 You would never do anything like that, would you? No, unless have a drink. Mm. <laughs> Music. Here you go, girls. some noise this time. Yes! I know this show works much better with a live audience. Who's going to make some noise this time? Yes! Music. music, you will think you are in the pictures, in the movies, in the